It's uh, Cam Cronin here at the H.R. McMillan Space Center for the Express. I'm standing with my good friend... Uh, Minder Samra. And uh, binoculars. You might think, well, hey, I'll just use a pair of binoculars to go out and look at the nighttime sky. A lot of people come down to the Space Center and they ask me, where should I go to get a good, clear view of the nighttime sky? At night, we're very close to the city center. There's a lot of light pollution coming off of uh, Vancouver and the West End, and it tends to sort of wash out the nighttime sky. So Reminder's here to tell us that there's certain areas that have been designated as uh, special places to observe the nighttime sky. Where could, where could people go in the Lower Mainland to try and find something like that? Well, in the Lower Mainland, my favorite spot is a place called McDonald's Park. Um, it's about an hour drive away from Vancouver. It's, uh, by the, it's close to Chilliwack, so okay. you take um, Highway 1, head, head east, um, take Exit 104. Um, and uh, you'll, you'll end up in this uh, small little area where it's uh, crowded by uh, a lot of trees. So the trees block off any uh, highway light. And of course, you're about an hour away from Vancouver, which is good enough to block out the Vancouver's lights. Now, light pollution is an issue with uh, all major cities. Uh, if you're ever out at night, it almost feels like it isn't night, and that is a problem not only for uh, looking at the nighttime sky, but they're doing research and saying that it's a problem for, for migrating birds, it's a problem for, for, for animals, and it's even a problem for humans. Um, we need it to be dark. People need it to be dark. Uh, our bodies are accustomed to getting about 12 hours of darkness um, every day. So it's nice that areas are opening up where we have these designa designated dark sky areas. So again, if you do want to look at the nighttime sky, uh, areas like McDonald's Park, perfect. Uh, as far away from the city you can get, if you're camping in the summertime, great chance to look at the nighttime sky. Um, if you want to learn more about the nighttime sky, well come on down here to the HR McMillan Space Center before you go on your trip and you'll be able to know exactly what it is that you're looking for. For the HR McMillan Space Center and the Express, I'm Cam Cronin. I'm Reminder Samra. And you know what? Astronomers do it in the dark. Thank you.